Hello at Lake Esmond today. Oh, I'm just getting a bite now. Bye. We're going to have to get a chat again. <laughs> just started recording. It's a beautiful chat. Beautiful chat. Pinned in the corner of the jaw. Look at that. That is beautiful. Just pinned. <clears throat> I bet say he's just pinned. Uh, he's in corners bait today. Uh, oh, come here. He's in corners bait. Look at that. That just slips out. Beautiful. Hopefully you could see that with the sun. I couldn't. The sunlight is really annoying. Hey, 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 hey. Beautiful chatty guys. Let's get a photo and get him back. Beautiful chatty guys. Let's get him back. He's gone. That is awesome. So I'll run you through my rig. Just a simple running sinker rig. Size one sinker, swivel. I've got six pound mono to a really small hook and then a bunch of corn. Simple as that and it's worked already. We've already caught one. Let's get back to fish. Another bite again guys. We fish. It is amazing like I just set my phone up ready to record and I just wait for a bite and I just bite almost instantly as soon as it's water. It's amazing. I reckon that was just one single bite and just went. But I'll give another pull. And hopefully you guys can hear me. Um, I'm not 100% sure if you can, but. A perfect weather, it's a little bit chilly, but overcast. It just fits the rain, it's just perfect. Ooh, that was a good hit. I reckon you might have seen that. <laughs> Far out. Um, now, the fisheries have recently stocked uh, 250 trout into this lake. Um, so there's a lot of little, little tackers here. Um, even now and again, you'll get a good kilo and a half one, but most of the little, little trout, soft trout in here. Is this fish going to come back or not? Don't think he is. Oh, 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 no, he's back. He had it on the way back in. No way. This is a good one. Take it. He's wrapped around something, but he's taking strength. Oh, he's off. That is amazing. I was wondering back in and he came in and ate it. That was awesome. He's a good one too. He's hooking right in the corner of the jaw. That is an amazing trout, you guys. He ate it on the way in. Not much, not very often that happens, guys. Look at this beautiful one. Oh, God. It's going to flop around a lot. That is... Put him down. Okay, there you go. There you go. There you go. Let me get your hook out. Let me get the hook out. There you go. That is a beautiful trout, guys. 
got a bite, missed him, wound it back in and he hit it again. That is a very nice chat there guys. Let's get a photo and get him back. Alright guys, beautiful trout here guys. Thanks for coming and giving me a bit of excitement, right? See ya. Look at that. Let's get back to fishing. Alright, we're getting bites again. Put this back down. Now we had a bit of drama before. Um, my little can of corn um, kind of rolled into the lake. So when I got my tazzy double rod out and chopped it straight down, <laughs> I got the I got the corn back, <coughs> which is good. But it had like half a tin left, so not very happy. It just got whacked a couple of times before. I've seen two trout paddling across the, across the top of the water. Yeah. Other than that, I haven't caught anything since the last one. So. It's a baby game. With trout, it's important. It's important to keep moving these um, rods and stuff around. And even if if you want a chance to catch catch one when you're riding an inch, one in nice and slow. Yeah. Oh. Now the initial bite is, oh, I'd say, you have any chance to get it between 25 and 1 minute um, from when you cast the rod in. Now he's waiting to get another bite. Hope it's not too long. The water's starting to... The ripples are starting to go away now, which is kind of a good thing. Guess we just have to wait for another bite. Here's a little Tazzy Devil I'm using. It's a bright orange one. Looks a bit like this. You can get it from BCF or your local tackle shop. <laughs> that is a gem, that thing. You can't go without it. Alright, guys, change up a bit. Got these bright orange salmon eggs here. They work really good for trout. I reckon I'm gonna put some of these on. Get this torn off. Work, but anyway. Always gonna change these up. Because if one thing's not working, you gotta try another. Same if one place is not working, just piss off to another spot. Not that hard. So just put the hook straight through, straight through the ball like that. You can put one on, you can put three on. Just like that. Make it look like there's no hook. Look at that. Just looks perfect. Let's get her in. That is a perfect cast too. Nice and keep her on, I don't think. Now 
Now let's get away.